but it's normally normal size, so I just wanted to be normal size. This is using the pre release version of Raspbian with. Uh, it's not coping well with this, this resolution. It's crashed. Is it? No, is it yeah. back? Is it back? <laughs> Oh, you've got two Gideros open at the same time. Oh, that's two of them, Should Would you Alt Tab, Alt F4? I'll just do Alt F4. Is that Alt F4? Alt F4. Alt F4. The gentleman wearing glasses, you look at me. Yes, you just raise your eyebrows. We've not met before. No. I'd like to introduce you to the gentleman on your left. He's called Ben Croston. Hello. Yeah. Ben, on at all, no? Is ben knows lots of really cool stuff about the Raspberry Pi, but he's also developed some of the GPIO modules for the Raspberry Pi. But he doesn't broadcast that. It's a bit of a secret. Should I have told anybody that? Oh, I shouldn't have mentioned it. But if you want to know more about what that's involved, talk to Ben. Also, who here, has anybody here has ever brewed their own beer? You have. Have you met Ben before? Because Ben does something that's even more cool than brew his own beer. He does something extra cool. You have to find out. I don't mean it's cool beer. <laughs> I mean, he does something extra cool with it that doesn't involve refrigeration. Not in it that way, anyway. This is a Lua program. It kind of looks a bit like, a like Python. But it runs a lot faster. Yeah. And if you have a look, it's quite. I'll scroll down, you see some if then and stuff. If, then, and. Yeah, you see if, something, then, something, and. Does that mean it's event driven? Event driven means basically there's an event there. With it. So yeah. when the button, which is an on screen button, gets touched, then this will happen. Yeah? Which kind of is a bit harder to do I think it doesn't have anything like. So now, I've got a player running oh. over here. Where is it? This looks really good when you see it over there. Yeah, when really you see it over there. That's it's making a good job of making it look bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to get it over here. It's probably just minimize that. And we'll see if I can run this. And, it, and the, that's it, yeah. So basically that's Space Invaders. Yeah. The sound effects as well coming over yeah, HDMI. Yeah. And if I... Can't see because it's, it's too small for the screen. Yeah? If I... Should we go? <laughs> no, it was a filtered screen. It was a green screen with white. Yeah. Black and white. I <laughs> don't <laughs> 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 the green means of plastic on the projector. <laughs> <laughs> tinted green if you want. Yeah. If you come over afterwards, I'll show you how you tint it green. Okay. Right. And this is the whole program for the space invaders. But somebody wouldn't but have to write. Line. Somebody wouldn't have to write all of that. They can take a lot of these blocks of code and change. Oh yeah. It in yeah. the if you go, if you if you build it. I've got a single page instruction sheet on how to build the whole thing. There's loads of examples. And you've shared uh, all of this on GitHub. Yeah, before. you just go to File, Open Project, and you'll see it. It's, it's crashing though because this is a pre release version of Raspbian. So it's not, it's pretty buggy. So Raspbian, when you move a window, it doesn't move it properly, it crashes. It must not know yet. It uses hardware open geo. It is really cool, but so that Anthony doesn't feel bad, later on... Yeah, just go over there. Don't tell him I said this, but go over there and go, Whoa! <laughs> that looks so good! But just don't tell him I asked you to do that. Yeah, okay. it's, it's really easy, it's better than Python to learn, especially for kids. And it's two, three hundred times faster minimum. And you can write arcane games with it. If you write a game and it looks quite good, you can also export it to Android, iOS, Windows, uh, HTML5, so you could develop a game on your Pi, but play it on your phone? Yeah. Yeah. You can develop a game on your Pi, you yeah. can play it on your phone, you can free. send it to a web page. Everything's free. Everything's free. Everything's free. Everything's free. Everything's free. Everything's free. I had children in my class who got this, went off and built their own stuff, and they showed it, and they had no idea how they did it. They just that that afternoon. Yeah. I'll show you that afternoon. Spent about 20 minutes 
half an hour showing us yeah. in the afternoon. They just went off and did it. And I don't know how yeah, they did that. Um, like a Tetris, didn't we? Yeah. Or block falling down. The floor isn't totally dissimilar to Python, is it? No, it's, no, similar. it's, it's yeah. similar in that it, you've got kind of the same structure, if, then, yeah. else, while, repeat, da 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 yeah. um, But it runs a lot faster. It's a lot, uh, the Python's a lot better suited to run something like this than Python. Python's just so, it's just the glue language like it accidentally became popular, it's crazy. Let's all get into the world. Okay, thank you. Oh, careful. Don't talk to each other. Don't talk to each other. Thank you.